What's up, my dudes? Hello, and welcome back to the Witch's House MV. It's, uh, I'm recording this during the daytime, so I can't even uh, begin attempting to darken the room, you know, to set the mood. So it's gonna be bright in my webcam, but at least I got my hoodie on, so hopefully that can set the mood enough. But yeah, babble babble, let's continue. Okay, and we are back. Viola is in the witch's house. I think we're on the fourth floor. Last time we completed the music puzzle where we had to create noise in four rooms and this door opened. And we're here in uh, this extremely creepy looking place. Uh, that statue reminds me of a weeping angel from Doctor Who, so I really hope I'm wrong about that. But uh, let's explore. What kind of items do I have? Just the letter. All right. A sobbing statue of a woman. It's a weeping angel. I can talk to the statue. Okay. Woman statue. My ring. I can't find it. Yo, if a statue is talking to you, that's a red flag. You gotta get the fuck. Alright, cool. I guess I am a... a uh, how old was I? 13 year old. Yes, I'm a 13 year old with very strong arms. And there's a hole in that wall now. There's nothing I can do, however. Okay, well, I'm just gonna leave then. Bye. Oh, it's locked. Perfect. Well, what the f... A dark stained glass window. Okay, this is very ominous. There's barely any music happening or noise. It's just quiet. And, you know, I don't like that. <laughs> a bit... My... My ring... Dude. Oh, what the f... Okay, now what? That was a very big thud. Was that a thud outside, or... Am I dead? Okay. That is not how this room used to look like. Can I go back? Oh, everything here seems to be the same. Alright, so this room is now different. A discolored vase. I don't remember there being a fireplace here. Question mark? A fireplace. <laughs> Let's look inside. What's the worst that could happen? Probably dead. There's a hole and an iron ladder going down. Okay. Uh, while I was bending over with my head in the fireplace, someone drew an arrow above me. Alright, let's descend into madness. I love that. Oh, wait. No. God damn it, game. There's an iron ladder in the fireplace. Alright, so we're back here. A bust of a male. I don't remember this place looking like that. Um, cool. Open the door. Let's follow the arrows. Okay, something's on the stove. The pot is boiling. Stop the fire. No! Was there a door there before? Open the door. Stop running away from me. Man, what the f- Is this- Like, this is some straight-up Hannibal Lecter type shit, dude. Chopsticks are stuck in the skeleton's ribs. Sure. Gold chopsticks. Great. Am I dead yet? Yep, that skeleton. Uh, he was right after me. Can I take the knife for protection? A heavy kitchen knife. The handle is covered with black sticky stuff. Cool, so I can't take the... No! Swear to God! <clears throat> can't take the knife. Alright, you know what? Fool me once, shame on me. Fool me twice, shame on you. That's not gonna happen. So, uh, what I have? Chopsticks? Oh wait, whoop. Didn't mean to do that. Gold chopsticks. Long, narrow chopsticks used for cooking. Oh, I probably need to interact with the, with the pot then, right? Um, items, got chopsticks, search inside. The lid is still on. A heated pot. Uh, you know what? Look. A metal pot, thoroughly used. Alright, smell. Smells odd, doesn't do much for your appetite. Open lid. Use the nearby cloth to pull off the cover. A lidless pot. Okay, I'm gonna search with the chopsticks because it's probably gonna be poison. Search inside. What did I find? Dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. The chopsticks caught something. 
There's a skeleton looking at me through the window. Got a pig ring? Hello? Skeleton boy? Alright, I'm just gonna go. It won't open. Oh no, not again. Oh, now what? <laughs> what? Maybe this door? Okay, good. Am I dead? You know what? I'm gonna poke him in the eyes. That didn't work. Do you want the ring? No, he doesn't. Do I go through here? Hello? Alright, I stepped on the skeleton. Was that enough? Mother... What am I supposed to do then? Is there something else inside of here? The skeleton had chopsticks in him. Do I put them back? Put back the goat chopsticks. Where? The ribs, I'm pretty sure. Stuck the chopsticks between the skeleton's ribs. Uh-uh. That head moved. I'm leaving. Bye. No. Okay. Haha, that was the right choice. What's happening? You hear someone coming down the stairs. Oh shit. Do I gotta run? Yo, I got a timer. I think I made it. Did I make it? What happened? It's a black screen. Okay, I think I made it. Yo, I'm running like hell. Okay, you know what? No, 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 no. Before that... Was that the witch? <gasps> I'm gonna save the game, dude. I don't like when I've done a lot and I haven't saved. But yeah, I think I managed to escape. Alright, here's your pig ring. Put on ring. Woman statue, are you happy now? This is it. Thank you. You heard something unlock. Alright. The door opened. Hey, progression. We did it and I haven't died once. Never mind. I'm about to probably die. I'm just gonna go. Very quickly. Alright, we're on a new floor. Okay, explain this to me. Initially, I thought I was going up the stairs. Then I thought I was going down because it looked more and more like a basement. And now there's windows and light coming through them. So am I going up or am I going down? What is up and down anymore? What just happened? <laughs> While I was ranting about questioning gravity, a freaking, uh, I don't know, like a Furby came out and uh, the witch stopped him from killing me. So she's a friend? Alright, I guess I gotta order them by color. Uh, I'm gonna put the that one there first. Okay. Green goes on green. Place that doll. Red goes on red. What goes on purple? <laughs> it kind of worries me. Because the witch has purple hair. I wonder if that's any indication. I'm not purple, so hopefully I won't become a doll. You heard something unlock. Dude, easy. Mm, and of course they look at me. Okay, at this point I just don't know. I'm in another dimension, that's for sure. Save point. Yo! Seems this is the top floor. <gasps> that makes no sense, but okay. So I have been climbing up. Interesting. A half-empty cup of ginger tea. Beautiful flower. How do you... The flower is talking to me. Is this Undertale? Is this the prequel to Undertale? How do you do? I mean, I don't know. Oh, okay. Birds eat greenery. Alright, so some birds must go there to eat the, the vines, I guess. Shelves lined with tea and canned sweets. Okay. Uh, cool, it, it's a flower tea party. A large clock. Time marches on. <laughs> Why do you do this? Oh, I can touch it. Sure, I want to touch time. It's never backfired before. No. Okay, let's not touch time. Touching time is always bad. Why are there three beds? 
look under table. <coughs> there's a skull on the floor. Sure, pick it up. Got a skull. Okay, there's blood now. Good, good. A comfy bed. Am I gonna fall asleep in one of them? Is this like um, the meme with they touch my spaghetti? God damn it, everything is falling apart around me. I don't know how to feel about this. Which is diary, and it has blood. Then a girl came over to play. Oh, she's writing about me, isn't it? A cute girl with golden but Yep, that's definitely me. I am dead and stuck in here forever. Pam pam pa na na ram. Alright, what's in here? It's pitch black in there. I need lights. Alright, let's save since I have a skull. Items. A small, well shaped skull. Alright. A book titled The Talkative Plants. Read. They're all beautiful and love to chat. Here are their characteristics. The white flowers are the most beautiful of the garden. Oddly enough, their petals glow in the rain. The red grasses are wise, but they're always lying, so be careful when conversing with them. The yellow flowers are lovely to a fault. The pollen produced by these flowers is a prized medicine that can both save and take lives. Hmm. That's a hint. A big hole with no visible bottom. Okay, perfect. I wonder when I'll be pushed inside of it. Probably soon. It's pitch black through the bars. Medicine. Someone's moaning inside? Talk. Wheeze! Hack! Cough! Medicine, you got any? I don't. Nah! They spit at you. Ew, dude. Piece of shit. <laughs> A metal birdcage. Look at it first. Something feebly flaps its wings. Open cage door. It's firmly shut. Well, gosh darn it. The red grasses are whispering to each other. Ha! Ah, you lying grass, you. Don't wanna... I don't believe you. Alright, so I guess I have to produce medicine... From the yellow flowers? Hello, flower. Just think, without her we would be the most beautiful of the garden. I know, right? Oh, sweetie. Honestly, she's such a nuisance. What does that mean? Oh, won't somebody ex that girl? If someone did. Ah, yes, we share some of our wonderful pollen. Oh, I gotta kill someone? Oh my, you have such big arms. Oh, ho, ho. What? Oh, hello. Eggs the flowers and you'll die too. Well, shit, dude. What does that mean? Oh. How do you do? Alright, I'm gonna exit. Should have listened to the blood on the wall. It was trying to protect me. No. Every time the dumbest shit gets me. It makes me so mad sometimes, dude. <laughs> like, first I get scared. <laughs> then I... Um, I laugh. And then I get mad. <laughs> hmm. I am questioning everything. You want to know how to X a flower? Okay, listen. I forget what exactly the proper way to X is. It was either cutting it up or uprooting it. None of the three ways to X are proper. You should just give up on it. Uprooting and plucking are both proper ways to X. So that means that the third way is the correct way. Wait, what did you say? Yeah, I gotta cut it up. Because they always lie. Where did you come from? There's a small skull on the chair. Don't, I mean, pick it up. Alright, I have two skulls now. Do they go in the beds, maybe? I'm starting to feel like they go in the beds. Alright, let me try. Can I put you here? Is that a thing I can do? No? Alright, I got no idea what to do with the skulls then. Um, Alright, let's try to cut the flower. I'm just gonna save one more time, just to be sure. There we go. How do you do? Uh, 
Tear it up. Damn it! The red grass is always lie, correct? So that was the only thing that I could do. I'm gonna try everything, you know? Okay, so I guess it's plucking. Alright, pluck it. With a strange shriek, the beautiful flower expires. White petals litter the ground. Take. Alright, I got white petals. Cool, cool. So, give me some pollen, dude. I heard it. I heard her ugly wail. I heard it. I heard it. I heard it. Nah, ha, 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 ha. This is Undertale. Ah, yes, our promise. Here you are. Got some white pollen. They're jumping. <gasps> the witch was sitting on the bench. Hello? Dude, is the black cat the witch's familiar, maybe? I'm starting to think that maybe that's it. Okay, white pollen. Gloopy pollen from the yellow flowers. The person grabbed the bars. Hey! Give me that! Give pollen. Slip the white pollen through the bars. The person swiftly grabbed the pollen. Ah, uh, ah? Uh, wait a sec. Don't have one? Without one? I can't smoke it without one! <laughs> he just wants to smoke weed. The birdcage has fallen over. The hinges on the door seem loose. Open cage door. Pride opened the door. Something invisible flew out. Of course it's invisible. What the f... Now... Why is everything littered with blood everywhere? It needs to be smoked. No? Alright, what's this? Hidden in the darkness. That sounds great. Oh, hello. The skull sealed the water. I'm um, sure an old pot. Reach inside. Am I dead? There's a skull inside. Alright, I have three skulls now. What? Do I need four? I guess I must need four. Place. Um... Ooh, I don't know. Right, left, right, down. Uh, no, it's forward. It's like this. It's uh, forward, left, right, forward. Um, left, right, forward, left, right. Forward, left, right. This is forward. Yeah, okay. But I guess I need one more skull. That I have not found yet. Alright. We're gonna figure this out, ladies and gentlemen. Don't worry about it. I don't know what I need to give the... Um, the junkie in order to smoke the medicine. But I can go here now. I've got 15 seconds. Poison fills the hole. Pass with colorless shoes. What does that mean? An empty bottle sits on the shelf. Take it. Got an empty bottle. There's nothing inside. Alright, I'm gonna have to leave. Is the timer reset? Yes, it is. Okay, good. The Skull Soldier. Read. There was once a soldier. Unbeknownst to him, his country had already perished, and so had he. Even in death, the soldier patrolled. Starting in the center of the castle ruins, he looked forward. Oh, right, left, forward, right, left. Yeah, okay, I already know that. Yeah, I don't know what colorless shoes are, but I don't think I have them, so I'm not gonna fiddle around with that yet. My shoes are definitely colored. Um... Alright, something hides in the darkness. Mm. I got an empty bottle. What can I do with an empty bottle? And flower petals. Hmm. Where's Poopsters? Where's Poopsters? Alright. The talkative plants. Let me see, what can I do with the white flowers? The most beautiful of the garden. Oddly enough, their petals glow in the rain. Oh, 
Alright, so they're gonna be my torch then. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna try anyway. Yep, I'm dead. Okay, well, you know what? I'm gonna try to turn on the water, see what happens. A lever. Pull. Nothing happens. Great! <laughs> Adds drop petals in bottle. <gasps> okay, bottle of petals. But that doesn't do anything. I gotta fill it up with water. I need one more skull. And I don't know where to get it. You know what? I might have an idea. I just remembered that room with all the skulls in it. Maybe I gotta get the fourth skull from there. Because this jump scare was here, which means that you most probably have to go back to it. Okay. A uh, statue is dead. A collapsed statue of a woman. Cool, cool, perfect. Whoa, what is this? Witch's Diary. I hate my illness. It kept me from going outside. It kept people from loving me. Huh. Yeah, you know, from all the Witch's Diaries that I've read... Um... It's a very sad story, you know, that girl. Definitely. Yeah. Book titled Dining with Aristocrats. Yeah, no, I already read that. I don't understand where I can get the other skull. Okay, well, um, I tried going back to that uh, Hannibal Lecter room with all, the, with all the skulls, hoping that that's where I find the last skull, but uh, I can't access it anymore, and that seems to be a bust. And I seem to be stuck, so I think this is where I'm gonna end the episode, because it's been 20 minutes regardless of, uh, you know, my, my troubles. So yeah, thanks a lot for watching, that's gonna be it for today. Uh, if you like the video, as always, leaving a like is very much appreciated if you want me to do more of this. And uh, all the usual stuff, as always, is down below in the description. Subscribe button, bell icon, join button, Twitter, Discord, all that good stuff. In case you didn't already notice, streams have moved officially back to YouTube. So keep your notifications peeled for that. And uh, yeah, that's all. Thanks a lot for watching the dudes. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.